message to the prosecutors involved in takeoff's case and situation a lot of people want to know what the hell are you guys doing i mean can you guys figure this thing out and do it the right way or certain connections stopping y'all from doing it the right way we're seeing prosecutors saying this they're saying that but they're not making sense of anything it seems like the prosecutors are the defense attorneys for little cam and the mob and folks it, it don't seem like they're trying to solve take off murder it seems like they're trying to clean a hip-hop situation to not make the city look bad so tourists can keep coming and the influx of you feel me financial gains can merit this situation so we're gonna get into what i'm talking about with video proof and everything else but i need y'all to do me one favor i need y'all to rock with the movement this is the i smoke hip-hop live platform i am your host dj bless one salute the i smoke hip-hop nation i need y'all to hit that like button like share subscribe to this video hit the notification bell salute the pesh mayweather man rock with my guy man follow the youtube channel also go support Pesh Mayweather DTE one time man rock with the movement and rock with what we go got going on let me get one cough out the way right quick I muted myself now prosecutors said this that was kind of alarming I'm about to forget about the little cam part I'm gonna fast forward it to the prosecutors part murdered in Houston appearing in court charging with having a gun he was not supposed to have Cameron Joshua is not facing charges for takeoff death but the arrest is the most significant development we've seen so far in this case which is now nearly a month old ABC now pay attention to that part i'm gonna rewind some of it you can tell even this newscaster in houston is pissed off like what the hell is going on in houston because he's like wait a minute man did the most significant thing you got to take off case is arresting a dude for violating his bond from a previous case and having weapons on him that would be cameron john's uh joshua so it, they're basically being sarcastic because it's kind of sad and pathetic that a case that's open with a hundred different cameras a hundred different witnesses more than the 40 people you estimated at the private party and all you have is a dude with uh, a weapons charge let me let him keep going man and remember this case is a month long now most significant development we've seen so far in this case which is now nearly a month old abc 13's maya shea is live at green street downtown where takeoff was killed and has the latest on what is still ahead in this case maya well, so many people are waiting for an arrest of a murder suspect. That is not what happened today. The man in question today was here the night that takeoff was killed. And according to prosecutors, he allegedly had a weapon. But let's be clear, he is not charged with shooting anyone. Houston rapper Cameron Joshua appeared in court today. Now, the being charged with not shooting anybody is what's getting a lot of people uncomfortable. Now, let's go to the prosecutor right quick hang on he though was crystal clear on one point cameron joshua did not shoot takeoff attorney christopher downey says it's important to note that now that's cameron johnson my, my bad y'all that's cameron johnson attorney now look at this doofus this prosecutor for houston this is the guy that's being tasked with also with all these sketchy figures of solving the case of one takeoff look at this prosecutor and tell me if this is not a, a knucklehead from the academy just graduated but both police and prosecutors have been tight-lipped we believe cameron joshua has been appropriately charged in this case and we're continuing our investigation into the death of takeoff joshua will remain behind bars until next week when he So just our statement is we believe Cameron Joshua has been appropriately charged in this case and we're continuing our investigation into the death of Tate Thank you all.
Can you spell your first last name? Tell sure, it's please. Christopher Downey, D-O-W-N-E-Y. I'm representing uh, Cameron Joshua. Can you tell us what happened in court today? Sure, Cameron Joshua has been charged with two counts of carrying a weapon. And it has uh, uh, only tangential relationship to this uh, shooting involving takeoff. He's not. Okay, I don't know how long I was muted and I apologize, but hang on. I don't know how long it was muted, but we skipping that part. The reason why I'm showing this, I don't know if it was muted or not. I'm gonna refrain it. I was showing why people don't care about what Cam situation is because the mocking and the trolling. And what I was also talking about, if you look behind him, you can see the many people who look like it was a game to them. Like it's almost funny the way the situation is going down, the way it is. So I, I don't know, man. It's one of them things. Y'all tell me, is the prosecutor lacking in this case? Do y'all think they're hurting the situation? Let me know how y'all feel about the prosecutor's prosecuting this case and situation hit that like button hit that notification bell thank you for rocking out with the i smoke hip-hop live movement love your family love your kids stay blessed